it's Julia, and today I'm going to be sharing with you DigiNail Studios. Now, DigiNail Studios is where you can create your own nails and print them off on a printer. So, let's put that. I like it because it comes with 500 nail wraps. Oh my goodness, just think about how many nails you can make with that. And it comes with a nail file and also a gloss coat, which gives it a nice finished look. So uh, let's jump right into it. Uh, this has a really easy tear away strip. It just opens up like that. Awesome. These are the sheets. This is the gloss coat and nail file. It comes with five sheets of digi nails. Each sheet has 100 nails on it, which I think is awesome. And this is the instruction sheet. I just downloaded the DigiNails app, and let me tell you, it's pretty cool. In one of the features, you could choose your paintbrush. And I'm just drawing a random design. Stick man. And uh, yeah, in one of them, you can have your text, so you can write different fonts, and you could say cool things on your nails. In another one, you can show patterns. You could choose your own, say you wanted that one. And you could also undo it when you make a mistake. And if you want to, you could save your design, but only when you're done. Next is stickers. You could choose some really awesome stickers. My favorite is the sleeping emoji. And what we could do here, good night. <laughs> the next one is you could take a picture from the web. So say I wanted to search up roses. I like that picture of the roses. When the picture's done loading, you can crop it to as big as you want to. And you can put the design on your nails as well. <laughs> so say I just wanted the roses right there. That's awesome. But right now, I'm going to undo this and another cool feature, which is probably my favorite feature, is you could take a picture of a pattern and then put it on your nails. So say I wanted to take a picture of my skirt. Like that. Press use photo. And what you can do is you could scale it, turn it around, you could make it bigger, which I'm gonna do. I'm also gonna turn it like that. And I saved. So basically, I love matchy matchy nails. So these nails will be matching to my skirt when I print them off. We're going to set up the alignment on the printer. So sometimes what happens is, all, since all printers are different, it can print on different alignments. So sometimes you'll see that the nails aren't quite aligned. So instead of using a good sheet of digi nail wrap, we are going to test it. So all printers line. print differently. Some print with the nails facing down, some print with the nails facing up, but mine prints with the nails facing down, so that's what we're gonna do. And the instructions are on the back of that sheet if you need any more help. So you slide that in, set this to A5, and let's begin. I'm using an HP 4500 printer, and my printer has an air print feature, which allows you to print right from your device right to your printer without new well, I'm gonna start printing my design. So what you do is you go to save. Do you want to print your nails? Yes. Now as you can see, there's 10 rows here, and that corresponds with the sheets on the paper. So this is row one, row two, all the way up to row 10. And what I really like about Digi Nails is that you can use one row for one hand and it doesn't print them all at the same time. So if you want to print many different designs on one sheet of paper, you could do that. But right now, I'm going to print the design and I'm going to select row one. So now I'm going to go to print and you can go to select printer. And since my printer is already on the network, I could just choose it right there. So now we're going to print. I just got my first print. I am so excited. And now we are going to put them on. Now I'm just putting my nails on and most of them seem to fit, but if there's a nail that is that does not fit you, like this nail right here, 
does not fit my finger. So what you could do, since the nails get bigger in size every time you go up one, you could try to select a bigger or smaller size. So I'm just going to go up to the next nail. Let's see if this one fits me. Yeah, perfect fit. Now file away the tips in a downward motion. Digi nails are actually not a paper sticker, they are a plastic nail wrap. So if you want them to stick well and last for a long time, then you should really wash your hands before applying the nail wrap. I just realized how awesome these nails look. Uh, at first I didn't really notice them, but as you get to wear them, as you get comfortable to them, they actually just look so I don't get anything on my nice clothes, I'm going to put them on a sheet just like that. Usually you would wait for these to dry and a tip is I think this looks a lot better if you put on a second coat. It makes it more glossy and it just gives it more of a finished look to it. So while I'm waiting for them to try, I'm going to do my other hand. A great tip to get the nails off is just to bend the paper, like what I'm doing right here. See? Easy. I am putting on that clear coat. Oh my gosh, I just had a really, really close call where I was playing with the nail polish and then it spilled onto my dress and I don't really want to get this ruined. So anyways, thanks to Bopo's spill proof bottle that really saved me. things about digi nails is you're able to post a design onto the gallery so you're actually able to see other people's designs and other people can see your designs as well so you can go to one like this this is someone's design and you can either go to print or edit I'm gonna edit this go to paint see and I can paint this whatever I want to I can even switch the colors. I'm going to go with that color. Now I'm going to do uh -huh. just for an example. I think this is probably one of the coolest toys I've ever seen. I got awesome results, and I really think you guys should try it. So, anyways, that is the end. Hope you guys liked it. If you want to see more videos, subscribe to my channel.